Oh, don't go up there. No, I can really go up there. Why did you have to go the same way as me? <laughs> this calls for only one thing that I can do. What's up guys? I'm Jim, which you've probably kind of already guessed if you were watching this video. I mean, it's, you know, the intro and all that. Just thought I'd give you all a welcome to my channel. This is my first motor vlog. I tell a lie, I did do one, well I tried to do one before. Didn't realise my camera battery was flat. Noob mistake. So I went out for about half an hour and it was just a waste of time. <laughs> Uh, just in case you're wondering, I'm currently riding my bike, which is a Kawasaki ZX6R G2. It's a 99 year, and I absolutely love it. I think it's a brilliant bike. I just thought I'd welcome you all to my channel, let you know uh, what my plans for the channel are. I mean, at the minute I'm doing quite a few how-to videos, uh, mainly on cars at the moment. It is. It is going to be a bit of a stick your fingers in all the pies sort of channel. I mean, I want to do some vlogs, like I am now, motor vlog. Uh, that was the original plan for my channel, but I've had a baby since, and uh, it's it's been pretty damn cold recently. I mean, it's December, uh, it's January now. It's December. I don't even know what month it is. It's January now, January 2018, so I hope you're all having a cracking new year so far. Uh, yeah, but all through November, December, it's been a bit too icy to go out on the bike, really. Hello, sir. Hello, sir. Uh, it's been a bit too uh, icy to go out on the bike, really, so, I've, you know, I don't really like riding in the ice. I'm not one of these riders that will only ride in the sunshine, as you can tell at the minute, but uh, I don't particularly like to ride out when there's quite a high risk of me dropping my pride and joy. It's not going to be one of those vlogging channels where you're going to watch me speeding around everywhere and doing dank wheelies. Uh, one, because I can't really save my life. I've never really tried on this. I've only ever wheelied by accident when getting a bit too vigorous with the old throttle and I don't particularly agree with doing them on public roads I mean if there's no one round crack on if you're good at them and you're all you're gonna do is hurt yourself yeah I'm gonna carry on with the how-to videos some of you uh, seem to like them but I also uh, I do a lot of gaming, so I'd like to do some gaming. Some gaming, some vlogs. You know, just mix it up a little bit so my, my channel's not just a I'm doing this kind of video and that's it. It's uh, all things gym. So anything I feel like making a video on, I'll do it. Now, I've not been on the bike properly in about two and a half, three months. I've been to work on it occasionally uh, because I've had a beautiful baby girl understandably she takes up quite a lot of time uh, I'm a big a big big fan of high vis uh, being seen on the road nice bright lights there sir uh, I don't know if you can see, I am wearing a high-vis jacket and a white top. Normally I've got white gloves and I've got good old white boots on. Some of you uh, real backers might laugh at that, but, you know, whatever gets me home to my daughter and keeps me safe on the road. There's plenty of morons on the road nowadays. Uh, last thing I want to do is be hit by one because they couldn't see me. Ooh, 60. Ooh, 
Oh, hello. Yeah, I like to be safe on the road, guys. Like I said, this, you know, this isn't the kind of channel where you're going to see me flying around corners at 130 mile an hour, dragging me. Because to be quite honest, on a public road, I think that is an absolutely idiotic thing to do. Like this corner, here some some people will probably take this at triple this speed. But you don't know what's around the corner. Like back there. There's a tractor, could be one around this corner, so, uh, you know, better safe than sorry, and some of you might laugh at me for that, I don't really care, you do you, I'll do me. <laughs> oh, oh, potholes. See, I'm not going to, uh, not going to lie, I don't ride or drive particularly like Miss Daisy myself. Ooh, green light. But uh, there's a time and a place for everything. And I tend to actually just speed up to the speed limit. I have no problem with racing someone off from a line up to 30 mile an hour. A bit like that uh, Ali G from back in the day. <laughs> Man, you got 32! You is a bad boy! See, I mean, at the minute I'm doing what, 46, and this is a 60. I mean, putting your throttle down is fun, don't get me wrong. Like I said, there's a time and a place for it. But uh, I actually do quite like just riding as well. Not breakneck speeds. I've got friends that like riding fast. You know, that's. That's up to them. We're each our own person, as long as they don't hurt anyone else. But, uh, me, I'm a bit, bit of an old git at heart. Some people say grumpy git as well, but, oh dear, oh dear, oh dear. Uh, yeah, some people say I'm a bit of a grumpy git at times, but... <laughs> Another reason I'm out on the bike is actually because I've just put a new pin lock on my visor. I'm testing it out so far, it's, it's working brilliant. I did buy another visor, a Max Vision pin lock visor, uh, from a company, I won't name who, with the uh, visor pin lock prepared, but. Uh, Although they said it was the right one for my helmet, and I purchased it, it is not the right one for my helmet at all. So I ended up getting annoyed and pulling out the pinlock pins and the Max Vision pinlock and drilling into my current visor. So yeah, it's because it's uh, a little bit chilly around the Never regions today. I thought it'd be a good. Good time to test it out. So we should blink off. Let's not start falling into that trap. So far, it's I'm pretty pleased with it. I should have just brought the Maxvision pinlock and some pinlock pins myself, anyway. But yeah, this didn't have the holes for the uh, pinlock in it. I've had to drill them in five mil drill bit. It's one of them moments. If you're a bike rider and you're doing it, you'll understand. You got the visor in your hand, took it off your helmet, holding it with a rag so you don't scratch it, and you got your drill ready, you've marked out all your points, and then uh, your bum starts twitching a bit as you drill it. <laughs> it's like, please don't let me have done this wrong. Otherwise, I'm gonna have to buy a new visor, which would suck big time. If I was going to attempt to wheel it, it'd be somewhere like this, an empty car park. But, uh, like I say, I can't wheelie for toffee. I can't wheelie a push bike, so I imagine wheeling a motorbike would uh, require some more skill than wheeling a push bike. 
don't get me wrong when I've been getting a bit too too hard on the throttle the front wheel has come up a little bit the first time that happened I absolutely pooped myself and just let chop the throttle like, ah, what's happening <laughs> I would hate to loop my bike well, I suppose that would that would make some more videos wouldn't it like how to loop your bike how to fix said looped bike yes yeah, it's, it's not worth it I'm, I'm not doing that <laughs> Well guys, that's going to be it for today's little vlog, vloggy vlog, motor vlog. <laughs> Sorry if it's been super cringe-worthy. Uh, I'm a bit of a noob at this, but you know I want to want to step my channel up a bit. I don't just want to do one thing, so. Whatever I feel like doing is what I'll do. So if you like the video, hit the like button, thumbs up. If you can, would help the channel out. Be sure to comment below in the comment box and subscribe for videos weekly, whether it be a vlog, a how-to, who knows. See you next time, guys. Peace. On a country road, somewhere near you, there is a housing estate being built.